And good afternoon, folks, and welcome to Chandler Field on the campus of the Webb Schools of California. It is time for the season opener for Webb School of California soccer, varsity soccer, here on the NFHS Network. And we are coming to you live thanks to the NFHS Network and our sponsor, Wilmington Trust. Thanks for joining us today on this blustery, windy Thursday afternoon here in early December. My name is Frank Dariano, and joining me is Allegra McDermott on the camera, Madison Steinorth working the production duties. And folks, they are one of many out here just to watch these web goals in the season opener. The web goals coming. Opening the season here against San Dimas. San Dimas already have their season underway, coming in with a record of 1-1. One and one. This is the first game as head coach for uh, Webb School of California head coach Greg Gherkin. He's been an assistant coach for the Gauls for the last two seasons, but this is his first game as head coach of the varsity. And the Gauls looking to make it a big one for him as the Gauls take on the Saints. Gauls in the white jerseys with the blue and gold numbers. San Dimas over there in the blue jerseys with the white trim. And you're watching Webb School of California Soccer on the NFHS Network presented by Wilmington Trust, our official network sponsor with more than a hundred uh, with years in the corporate trust business that is Wilmington Trust with Southern California locations in Los Angeles and Costa Mesa. As the game is about to get started here, it'll be San Dimas kicking off. Kenneth Franco, number 10 among them, ready for the opening kick. And as you can hear the blow through from my microphone, it is definitely a blustery day here at Chandler Field. Winds blowing right on through down from the San Gabriel Mountains. A perfectly clear sky. We may be here in the Inland Empire, but this might as well be the Windy City as far as I'm concerned. Between San Dimas and Webb. And the game is underway. In goal for Gauls, number one, R.J. Dukey, son of Webb School of California varsity basketball coach Rick Dukey, and the ball corralled by Cole Sego. Cole Sego looking to square it up, passes quickly to Ryan Ataka, back to Sego. Sego kicks it all the way back to Frank Hu, Webb freshman, one of four freshmen here on this varsity soccer squad. Long boot along the far sidelines. Kicked back by San Dimas. Jonas Gherkin in on it, number three for Webb. Gherkin goes for the high header. And the ball rolls out of bounds. Throwing it in with some force there is Nick Jung. And if you've been with us so far this uh, season for Web Athletics, you know that name. Nick Jung, of course, a star on the Web football team last season. Moving ahead is Yolbar's Mira, number 12. And that'll go back to San Dimas. Luke LeVay in goalie for the Saints, son of San Dimas head coach Eric LeVay. Nice urgency there on the part of Lawrence Tsumi. And the ball flies right near us, right in front of our broadcast booth. Chasing after it was number 20, Cesar Duran. And it'll be a throw in on the part of the Gauls. Number seven, Cole Sego quickly into Ryan Otaka. Ball goes back to the Saints here. Specifically, number two, Derek Covarubius throws it on in. 
right in front of us here. Ryan Ataka. Up to Lawrence Tsumi. Up to Jonas Gherkin. Stolen back by the Saints. Headed away. Nick Jung keeps it away. And the ref blows the play dead after that uh, collision between Nick Jung and San Dimas' Junior Duran, number 15. Blustery day. You can hear the wind just blowing on through us here at at Chandler Field. Start of a very very busy winter season of broadcasting and of course of web athletics. Six different teams will be bringing you over the course of this winter season. Those of you who joined us for the inaugural game for of the season for Vivian Webb soccer yesterday. Thank you for joining us. Vivian Webb defeating Ganesha 4-1. to one. And that high, long kick. No dice for Elijah Phipps of San Dimas. RJ Dukey will have to roll on back. <laughs> Take a stroll all the way back to the Webb tennis courts behind our portable buildings back there to make it happen and to get it back. it to Cole Sego, back to who, and now back to Takemura, Sego, Sego tripped up but stays on his feet, and out on it now, is Yolvar's Mira, a long run deep into San Dimas territory there for Ryan Ataka, and out of bounds, a strong effort there by the Gauls. Way in the far corner. Kick in there for Jonas Gherkin. And the Gauls get it back. That ball trails to the left of the goal. And LaVey will pick it up for San Dimas. San LaVey, long. Miss header there. Possession goes back to the Saints. And that boozle on the far sidelines. Thrown in along that far sidelines. Cleared back out. Mira heads it off nicely. And now it's Asumi. Mira with the defense. Kicks it back. Luke Gonzalez in there as well. And it's a free play here for this for the Gauls. What a run. Ball quickly travels way back into web territory. And it will be a goal kick. Again, you're watching Web School of California Soccer here on the NFHS Network, presented by our network sponsor, Wilmington Trust. With more than 110 years in the corporate trust business, Wilmington Trust with Southern California locations in Los Angeles and Costa Mesa. Seven minutes in, no score on this blustery Thursday afternoon. And the play along. 
on the far sideline. Cleared far for Luke Gonzalez. May have a play here for Jonas Gherkin. Jonas Gherkin. Back into it, Gonzalez. And before it can arrive at the goal, Derek Covarrubias gets a leg in on it. But the Gauls stay on it. Along the far lane. Gherkin. Fighting for it for possession. That ball will roll all the way back to midfield. But Junior Duran for San Dimas gets on it. And out of bounds it goes. An impressive run there by Duran. Matt Garcia will go ahead and throw it in. Number 17 for the Saints. Tosses it in. And it goes over everyone's head and into the hands of R.J. Dukey. Dukey, on up. Ahead, here's a breakaway here for Lord Satsumi. Satsumi with three defenders around him, shoots, got it! Lawrence Satsumi gets the first goal of the season and the goals lead it one to nothing. Brilliant effort there by the Webb Jr. What a way to open the season there for the Gauls. Ten minutes in. The Gauls taking a one nothing lead. And they'll keep the pressure on. Luke Gonzalez and Jonas Gherkin string, staying strong in the front field. That ball travels once again out of bounds, and uh, well, thankfully, RJ Dukey has one sitting right near the goal. So you end up going traveling down the road to get the ball back. He'll set up for a goal kick here. Nice effort right in front of us between Ryan Otaka and Junior Duran. Webb gets it back. On a play by Tsutsumi. The Gauls will have to contend with it. Facing pressure from San Dimas. Matt Garcia. Nick Jung gets a leg in on it and clears it away, at least for the moment. Out to Luke Gonzalez. Was looking for Jonas Gherkin. But the Saints respond. Cole Sego. Up to Mira. Yobar's Mira. And back to Nick Jung. That ball stays in bounds along the far sideline and pushed ahead for Gherkin. But now it rolls out of bounds just before he can get there. Elijah Phipps will pick it up and hand it over to Dylan Ware, who will throw it in for the Saints. stoppage there. It'll be a free kick for San Dimas. Elijah Phipps, a senior defender for the Saints, gets it all the way back and R.J. Dukey has to work quickly but does get a hand on it, corrals it. 
thought about throwing it off to the near side. We'll go for the far side and let Nick Jung handle it. Jung, quick. These great plays along the far side. With Jung putting the boot into that. Web fans, of course, already familiar with Jung's uh, footwork and being Webb's punter on the football team. And in fact, uh, trying to get it up to Luke Gonzalez, who shared some of the kicking and punting duties with Jung on the gridiron this past fall. But a wide open break for Gherkin. Jonas Gherkin taken down from behind. No call from the ref. Play on between Gonzalez and a couple of blue jerseys. And the ball rolls out of bounds. Possession going back to the Gauls. Well, Mother Nature surely playing a role in this one, folks. A long kick goes all the way to the side of the goal. Nice interception stolen away, Ryan Otaka. Back to Sego. On back to Frank Hu. And now Nick Jung. Once again, trying to set up Luke Gonzalez. Luke Gonzalez. And that outlet kick all the way to the far side has to be given San Dimas coach Eric LeVay all sorts of headaches. The Gauls nearly scoring once again, and they'll try it again. Here comes Gherkin. Tries to center it. There for Ryan Otaka. But goalie Luke LeVay scoops it up for the Saints and heads it away to Junior Duran. Duran to Franco. Lawrence Atsumi. Quick, good save there, R.J. Dukey. Johnny on the spot to stop the rush. Some 15 minutes into this game, Webb leads it one to nothing. Off of a goal in the 10th minute by Lawrence Tsutsumi. And the Gauls threatening again, but this one just rolls out of bounds. San Dimas will take over. And Yolbars Mira has something to say about it. He gets it back for the Gauls and passes it back to Cole Sego. Sego. Feeds Otaka. Can he get there along the near sidelines? Ref signals a, a corner kick here. It'll be Lauren Tsutsumi handling the duties here. It's in, looking for the header, punched away. Gall stay with the ball. And San Dimas wisely clears it away. Take that back, ball went out on Webb last touch, so San Dimas will get it back with the ball way in the back half. Intercepted Takamira. Looks like Nick Jung's going to have to go a little bit off-roading to pick up the ball over there. On the far sidelines, here he comes with the ball. Again, for those of you who have never been to 
Webcams were running right off of a little creek bed over there, right next to Chandler Field. By our count, 22 minutes left in this first half. And here comes a corner kick for San Dimas. Headed away off the roof of our uh, boardable building here. That one probably landed over on the tennis courts. Back to Webb now, RJ Dukey. Waiting for his goals to set up and here comes the ball. That ball gets held up in the wind again, and San Dimas takes advantage. Cole Sego has to get it back, kind of helping out Dukey there again. The wind speed certainly playing an advantage. Ooh. As the ball floats right near us. Cole Sego quickly into it. Mira. To his brother Yolbars, Mira. Nick Jung playing along the far side. Back up to Susumi. And Mira. San Dimas. Goals. Having played much of the last couple of minutes with the ball in their half of the field, but they'll get it out of the way. Here's an outlet for Ryan Otaka. Again, the wind just blew that one right by Luke Gonzalez. Had a, a bit of a seam. But contending with this driving wind here is going to make any high passes. Very questionable the rest of this game. We'll look to keep the ball on the ground for success here for both teams. Ball goes out of bounds. It'll be a free kick coming up for San Dimas's Kenneth Franco. Mira will contest him, and that boot is centered. Nice, well played save, RJ Dukey. Gonzalez, that ball once again bouncing away. possible that the wind could actually be picking up here? I think it is. Blowing straight out of the north, coming right down off the mountains and straight across this pitch. Nico Bacola for San Dimas. Before he can get it up to his man, Dukey sco scoops it up again. RJ Dukey in the first game of his final soccer season for Webb. Playing very well. Back to Yolbar's Murr. Oh, what a collision there. Takamur went for the 
header and was just kind of bounced around. Andrew Cox, the junior number 14 to four. San Dimas got in the way. Along the way. Sego. Sego works around him very well. Sego through to Gherkin. Taken back by San Dimas. Nick Jung with the run there. He's made that far side quadrant over there nearly impossible for anything to happen here for the Saints. Kick here by Dukey. Makes it through to Zach Hammond. On the way, Luke Gonzalez Nearly got there in time to make a play, but Luke LeVay scoops it up. That one rolls long. Nick Chung once again there, showing his prowess on the defense. And here comes RJ Dukey. The Gauls have looked very well on defense. They've been challenged several times here in the last 10 to 15 minutes, and they've come through each time. Mira misjudged it, and held up there by Ali Nelbandian, number 11, for San Dimas, and the Gauls will take it back. Long, beautiful kick there. Cole Sego looking to outlet it to the goals. Referee stops play. Setting up for a free kick here is Jonas Gherkin. And the Gauls lead this one one to nothing on an early goal by Lauren Tsutsumi. And that one nearly got past the goalie. Here's a chance for a shot and it goes just wide. Brilliant near play there by uh, Kellen Wilmore, number four who's been making plenty of noise even as a freshman. Was a rising star on the Webb Cross Country team in the fall. Competed in the CIF Southern Section Championships just a few weeks back out in Riverside. And the Gauls keep it in, in the, keep on the pressure. Here's a shot headed away. Jonas Gherkin wanting a goal. Nearly keeping it in bounds with Tsutsumi, but it does go out of bounds. San Dimas will take over. My apologies there. Pages just rising up. Gauls will take it back. Try to take it back. He does. There's Wilmore. Wilmore ahead to Satsumi. Gets the outlet. Here comes Luke Gonzalez. Luke Gonzalez shoots. And it's just a bit too high. Luke Gonzalez.
just too much there. Very quickly, San Dimas has it deep into web territory. And rolls out of bounds. Getting down to nearly the final 10 minutes of this half. A 1-0 lead for Webb. Close shot there for Luke Gonzalez. And the clearing, but not the accuracy. That ball sailing over R.J. Dukey's head, but landing safely to the near side of the goal. Zach Hammond with it now. Picking up will be Derek Covarubias. And in fact, actually looks to be a substitution here. Sandim is making some substitutions. And you are watching Web School of California Soccer on the NFHS Network. Presented by Wilmington Trust. More than a hundred years in the corporate trust business. Wilmington Trust with Southern California locations in Los Angeles and Costa Mesa. Coming here, here comes Dylan Ware for San Dimas. A high, long one. That one rolls out of bounds. Sutsumi. Nice play to get it away. And outlets it to Brandon Yip, number six. tries to get through it and he does nice play the goal is working through it here comes Lawrence Satsumi he's got two players in front of him well played Cole Sego to Lawrence Satsumi and now Jonas Gherkin will punch it up to the far side too much mustard on that one though Luke LeVay gets out for it Punch through. Here comes. Went for attack, Amira. Amira, back to Wilmore. And that one wanders out of bounds there. With Nick Jung chasing after it. And the 
Gulls, get it back. Clearing it away. We're trying to. Contact there blows the play dead. Free kick here, centered in. Made it through past everyone, except of course for RJ Dukey. Good leg into that one. Nice play up there, Frank. Who? Mira. Yolbar's Mira looking to stay with him, and he does get it out of bounds. Well played there. Good ball. five minutes of this half. Sandimas threatening right in front of the goal. Cleared away very nicely. Kellen Wilmore at least for the minute. Jonas Gherkin looking to finish it off. Stays alive, Satsumi. Here's a chance for Sandimas potentially. And Cole Sego battens down the hatches. Wonderful display of urgency there on the part of the Gauls. More substitutions for Eric LeVay. San Dimas team, Kellen Wilmore, will come out for Webb. Replaced by fellow freshman Orion Levin Mars. Another face you may remember from the Webb cross country season. Right on the kick goes for the low throw and smartly there with the wind just kicking up once again. That was a smart play as the wind is going to make any high kick suspect right here. Nick Chung clears it out. Satsumi goes over his head though. time to get up. Well, I tell you, folks, this is like being in a wind tunnel almost. And you can see the ball getting held up in the wind there. That is going to make any high kicks really tough to do, but oh, a near outlet there for Jonas Gherkin, but it bounced off the back of one of the San Dimas players. ahead. Lavin Mars to Nick Jung. That one stays in bounds. Mira. Outlet ahead looking for Brandon Yip. Gauls will get it back. Mira. 
Seago. Cole Seago tripped up and down. Sandimas will try to get it back, but Mira back to Sutsumi. To Seago. Back to Mira. Looking for his outlet. Said we'll kick it back to Frank Hu. Who? On the long play to Lavin Mars. Back to Mira. Cole Seago. Nice play to get around him there, Cole Seago. Seago makes it across midfield on the short play. And ahead, Lawrence Tsutsumi. He's got one goal this game so far. And before he can make it two, nice defensive play. And a player for Sandima shaken up on that play. That was uh, number 13, Elijah Phipps, who made the nice offensive play there on Lord Tsutsumi. Ball back in play following the corner. Centering it. Rolled on by Sandimas and the headers. Gets the ball back to midfield. But Webb keeps it in the Sandimas half. Saints push it away. Frank who needing to chase after it. Taken down from behind by Nico Bacala of Sandimas. Winding down towards stoppage time here. Webb playing a very strong first half. And looking to take a 1-0 lead into the break. California no. 40 minutes in the books it is Web School of California 1 and San Dimas nothing You are watching Web School of California Soccer on the NFHS network presented by Willing to Trust We'll be back in just a moment
and thank you for joining us here for Web School of California Soccer on what is an absolutely blustering Thursday afternoon here at Faculty Field. Frank Dariato here with you, along with my excellent broadcast team. Madison Steinorth has been working the production duties. Allegra McDermott has been on the camera. The Gauls lead this one one to nothing at halftime on a goal by Lawrence Satsumi. And we'd like to take this opportunity to thank our many sponsors. First, our official network sponsor, Wilmington Trust, with more than 110 year, 100 years in the corporate press trust business. That's Wilmington Trust with Southern California locations in Los Angeles and Costa Mesa. The Web Spirit Store is the only place to find web official web athletics gear. Click on the Spirit Store tab at web.org, the athletics tab at web.org, I should say, and click on Web Athletics Spirit Store to support your goals. Cyber Monday has been extended at the Spirit Store. Enter the promo code CYBER16 to take 15% off all orders of $60 or more. This deal is good through this Sunday, December 4th. Again, enter the promo code CYBER16 to take 15% off all orders of $60 or more. That offer is good through Sunday. Empire Nissan in Ontario is a longtime supporter of Web Athletics. Empire has just won the prestigious Nissan Global Award for 2016 as one of the top dealerships in the world for sales, customer satisfaction, and owner loyalty for Nissan. Empire Nissan, 1377 Kettering Drive in Ontario. The Double Tree by Hilton Claremont. Web fans, if you're coming to visit the Web School campus, there's no better choice for a hotel than the Double Tree. Just minutes from campus, the Claremont Village, and the Claremont Colleges. The Double Tree by Hilton Claremont features custom designed beds, flat screen TVs, and free Wi Fi in every room. The Double Tree is at 555 Foothill Boulevard in Claremont. Jeff Hamill and Nicholas Neese at Wheeler, Stephen Sotheby's International Realty are your go-to sources for the best real estate service in the Claremont area. Wheeler, Stephen Sotheby's International Realty at 500 Foothill Boulevard in Claremont. And Hendricks Pharmacy, your family-owned and operated pharmacy in the heart of Claremont Village. At 137 North Harvard Avenue in Claremont, Hendricks offers a international, an international travel clinic to help you stay healthy while traveling overseas. Again, that's Hendricks Pharmacy. Back on the pitch, the Web soccer team, as we get ready to start the second half. They lead it one to nothing. And we're back at it here for Web Athletics, Web Soccer. The Gauls lead it. One to nothing here. As we start this second half, folks, again, we are dealing with just one heck of a wind of a blustery day this afternoon here at Chandler Field. I especially want to thank my broadcast team for doing a wonderful job here in the Elephants. 
Madison Steinorth now on camera, Allegra McDermott now on the production duties, and they are doing an incredible job despite this blustery wind. Who else is doing a good job? Here comes Jonas Gherkin trying to center it in for a shot. Luke Gonzalez couldn't quite get there in time, but the Gauls will keep the pressure on. Here's Yolvar Smur. Ah. Goal kick coming up here for Luke LeVay. Gherkin. Playing long. Nick Jung trying to keep the pressure on here. Gauls take, try to extend their 1-0 lead. A header by Luke Gonzalez just sails wide of the goal. Goal kick coming up here. And they decide to go low. To number 19, Henry Landers. Nice steal away, Yolbars Murr. Get up to Satsumi. And now the Gauls having to get back on defense real quick. George Nelson boots it up to Kenneth Franco. Getting it through. Dangerous play for the Gauls. R.J. Dukey kicks it away. And out of bounds, it'll be off for a corner. It is a very busy day and a very busy week for Web Athletics. Just up the hill, the 33rd Web Invitational Basketball Tournament going on. Once again this evening, our Gauls scoring a 53-50 victory last night over Ganesha. And they'll play Pasadena Poly, which is going to be a very tough one later on tonight. Up at Lesbury Gymnasium, we'll be bringing you the Gauls' third game tomorrow here on the NFHS Network. Game time and opponent to be determined. That was a very strong showing and a very good game for Coach Rick Dukey's team last night against Ganesha. Vivian Webb Soccer opened the game the season with a win yesterday, four to one. Very impressive against Ganesha. Vivian Webb Basketball defeated Marshall Fundamental last night, 36 to 30. They played this afternoon at Gary. And another burst of wind coming on through here. We, of course, are blessed uh, most of the year with the beautiful weather here in Southern California, but now these winds are giving us a whole nother meaning of the word elements. No rest this season for this Web School of California soccer team. They head on up to Lancaster for a tournament tomorrow. They have two games. Speaking of tournaments, Vivian Webb Water Polo opens the season at the Montclair Tournament. Two games this evening and three more tomorrow in Montclair. And Reb Web Wrestling open the season. A breakaway here, Jonas Gherkin punched away. Jonas Gherkin nearly had the goals up 2-0. We'll have 
a near corner kick coming up. Again, Web Wrestling opened the season last night at the Deep Toledo Quad Meet. Join us tomorrow for our inaugural broadcast for the season of Web School of California Basketball. But we still finishing up here at the pitch. Here comes Lawrence Satsumi. Widely cleared. Jonas Gherkin will go for the corner kick here. That one too narrow. Goal kick upcoming. Luke LeVay set to do the duties for San Dimas. Gauls lead this one 1-0. One As we are approaching 50 minutes gone by in this game. Header, kicked away. Nice offense here for Webb. Zitsumi ahead to Luke Gonzalez. Can he get there in time? No, he won't. The ball sails long. A great cross pass there. Goal kick coming up here. Gonzalez looking to create something here on the ball. Keeping the speed on. Luke Gonzalez. And kicked away. Corner kicks have been going to the Gauls' advantage so far. Can they make it work again? Gonzalez. Perhaps try to set up Sutsumi. Or Mira. The wind again pushing that one out of bounds. It is going to be tough to get any high kick to make it work there. As you see, Luke LeVay just keeping it on the ground. Nice advance there for the Gauls. Looking ahead for Gonzalez or Gherkin. Nice play, nearly in. Another near chance for Luke Gonzalez. And you have to be thinking that either that he and Jonas Gherkin would both love to put one in the back of the net. As would any member of the Gauls, of course, but Gherkin and Gonzalez have been there on several chances so far this game. Mira, Satsumi, ahead to Gherkin. Offsides there. Back to San Dimas. 
and a kick there. That is looking to be a card. Yellow card is there on Jonas Gergen. And with that, Coach Greg Gherkin will make a substitution, taking out his son Jonas and putting Brandon Yip in. Kellen Wilmore looks to be ready coming on the pitch as well. Sandim is getting ready to make some substitutions here. Gauls have led this one since about 10 minutes into this game on a goal by Lawrence Tsutsumi, who's there with the ball now. Callan Wilmore. Wilmore, a nice run, punches it ahead to Yip. Tsutsumi, Lawrence Tsutsumi has got some room. Feeds Gonzalez, and the shot just wide, Luke Gonzalez. Well, that close call there brings some excitement here on the sidelines. Shot goes all the way over the goal. LeVay will be back. Short kick. Kellen Wilmore using the urgency. He'll stay with it. And that one goes out. Back to San Dimas, but Kellen Wilmore. Great run there. Mira. We'll get to Ataka. Satsumi. The Gauls will reform here. Booted ahead, Nick Chung looking for Luke Gonzalez. Gonzalez has an opening, gets there. Nice ball. Centers it in for Wilmore. Still at it, still at it. Wilmore, Gonzalez works out of danger. Back to Yolbar's Murr. Kellen Wilmore stolen away. Here comes Cesar Duran. Duran. Too much on it, and R.J. Dukey wisely clears it out.
San Dimas trying to keep the pressure on. They know that the way this game has been going, another web goal would be disaster for them. Putting the onus on the web defense, but they are responding here. Play up to, a, to Satsumi, rather. Lawrence Satsumi boots ahead, looking for Luke Gonzalez on a breakaway. Can he get there? And the ball will head out of bounds before he does. Dylan Ware will throw it in for San Dimas. Satsumi. Oh, a breakaway here potentially for San Dimas. But kicked away. RJ Dukey batting down the hatches once again. It'll be a throw in here for Kellen Wilmore. Satsumi. Play back here. Yep. Brandon Yip working with it. San Dimas gets it away and coming on back. Clears it out to the midfield. Frank Hu intercepts it though. Open lot there. Punched out for Yip. San Dimas will take it back. Heading into the 60th minute of this game. The Gauls leading one to nothing. And looking to give Coach Greg Gerken a victory in his first game as Webb head coach. Again, catch Coach Gerken has been an assistant here for the last two years. A tight game here going on. Nice play, R.J. Dukey. And the Gauls looking for that elusive second goal. What a boot, though. Dukey. Luke Gonzalez, can he get there? He does. He boots. And it hits the crossbar. R.J. Dukey and Luke Gonzalez covered the entire pitch there. And only the crossbar said no. Satsumi trying to get it away. As Sandima stays with it. Center in. Nice punch out, Nick Jung. Yip. Brandon Yip. Yovars. Frank Hu. And cleared away. Smart play there for Cole Sego.
And for the moment, the wind seems to have finally died down. The chill, chilly temperatures, of course, still out here. But if you were with us earlier, folks, this has been... I've said it before, but it's worth saying it again. It was like playing in a wind tunnel. Wilmore, out of bounds, ball goes back to Webb, throws in for Gonzalez, corrals it, and clears it out though. Wilmore with the header, Gherkin puts it back, Jonas Gherkin back in after the yellow card. Trying to set up Gonzalez. Let's see if he can get here this time. Too much, though. Luke LeVay scoops it up. And throws it here along the near side for Dylan Ware. Elijah Phipps gets it. And out of bounds, Brandon Yip with the defensive play there for the Gauls. Throw in. Right back out, says Jonas Gerken. Another one, Kellen Wilmore this time. Last touch though by Sandimas. Webb gets the ball back. Nick Jung will throw it in. And throws it long. Too long though. Ball goes all the way back to Sandimas as the wind starts to kick up again. Wilmore. Back to Jung. On the way. Sandy Emus keeps it. And they'll try to make a run here along the far side. Stolen away, though, by the Gauls. And that was a push down. Ref stops the clock there and shows a yellow card. With that, Coach Gherkin will make a substitution. Orion Levin Mars coming back in for Cole Sego. Approaching the final 15 minutes of this match. Webb trying to hang on to a 1-0 lead. Dangerous play. Right in front of the goal, cleared beautifully. And cleared again. Nick Jung and Luke Gonzalez hanging in there. Keeping the ball away from the net. Shot on goal, blocked R.J. Dukey. And the boot, high. Trying to set up Luke Gonzalez again. Gonzalez gets there. Brandon Yip. And just taking out a couple of blue jerseys and made it to him. Brandon Yip, slow to get up. 
All goes back to San Dimas. Well, it's been a very physical game, I got to say. One that Webb leads, and they'll take the ball back. Lawrence Tsutsumi. His goal is the difference in this game. Now the tree branches starting to wave again. Uh, an outlet away? No, too far for Luke Gonzalez. The weft blows his whistle. Kick coming ahead here, Elijah Phipps. Webb back with it. Outlet to Luke Gonzalez. But too much strength on that kick. LaVey will pick it up. And throw it along the far side. Dookie. Long run here. Will this be it for Luke Gonzalez? Well, Luke Gonzalez has been looking for that goal all game long. You can tell he wants it. And his teammates doing their best to feed him. They'll have another chance here on a corner kick by Lawrence Atsumi. Suzumi contending with the wind. It sails wide. The shot nearly in Yolbar's Mur, uh, Mura. And Luke Gonzalez, the second chance. No good, but a near goal there by Yolbar's Mura. RJ Dukey back at it. Away. The Gauls will stay with it. Lawrence Tsutsumi with the defender coming up right behind him. Keeps the ball. Tsutsumi. Oh. Luke Gonzalez had his clearance there. But the ref said no. Brandon Yip shaking off, shaking up on that play rather. And he'll come off Ryan Otaka back in. Kick is away. Ten minutes to go in this game. Webb tried to preserve a one nothing victory here. Will the goal by Tsutsumi stand up? He's got the ball now. And he feeds it ahead. This could be the chance, but no, far too much of a kick. Web forwards have been beating their men off the pitch on those outlets. It's just a matter of getting it down. Here's a chance now, Otaka to Luke Gonzalez. The Gauls stay with it. Here's the kick through.
now these players having to tend, contend not only with the cold, the wind, but of course the debris. But they will play on. San Dimas would love to get out of here with at least a tie, but the Gauls say no, at least for now, Orion Levin Mars. Sandim is keeping the pressure on. Satsumi. Otaka. Feeds Luke Gonzalez. Let's see if he can get this one going. Dribbles by one defender. Luke Gonzalez. Luke Gonzalez. And three. Saints defenders prevent him once again. I tell you, if Luke Gonzalez gets a goal, this place is going to erupt. It'll, of course, erupt if any member of the goals put one in the neck. But with the effort he's shown time and again, you can tell Luke Gonzalez wants that goal. They'll go with the corner, headed away, kick, nearly in. That is a goal. What a goal there. Bounced off the top of the crossbar and landed in, and the goals are up 2-0. Big play, big, big play. Well, the initial call seemed that it was a goal. San Dimas arguing their case. And San Dimas' Kenneth Franco shown the yellow card as a result. So that big goal here coming in the final final 10 minutes, giving Webb a two nothing lead and all but securing a win on opening day. But there's still a few minutes left to be played, of course. Wilmore up ahead, Gherkin. And that one will sail right on over us. That ball bouncing away. Nearly into the uh, front yard of my broadcast partner, Brian Rogers. His house just behind us here on the web campus. Winding down to the final, less than five minutes left in this game. A physical one it has been between the Gauls and the San Dimas Saints. And they'll play on. With the wind fully kicking up again, Luke Gonzalez. Satsumi with the header. Satsumi. Lawrence Satsumi.
goes out of bounds. Takamura will throw it in here for Webb. As Sandimas makes a couple of substitutions. Free kick here for the goals. They get the ball set up there so that the wind doesn't blow it away. And the goals just taking their time at this point with a 2 nothing lead looking to extend it. Here's the, key, the cross and it sails fully past everybody. Coming down to the final two minutes of this game. Now, well, between the wind. Oh, this one is not over. Jonas Gherkin. Jonas Gherkin still with the ball. Shoots. And it goes just wide. The 2-0 lead for Webb. Should it stand up? This will be a memorable one for the Yusuf boys and their coach, Greg Gherkin. Jonas Gherkin, too far to go for that one. You got it, Bobby. Harmon. Gall stay on the ball here. Punched ahead. Looking for Jonas Gherkin from Ryan Otaka, but no deal. Cole Sego will go ahead and throw it in. Sego in the Harmon. Hammond. And that will do it. The Gauls claim a 2-0 victory over San Dimas. And Coach Greg Gherkin has the first victory of his career as a web, as web varsity head coach. We'd like to thank our sponsors for our broadcast. First, of course, our network sponsor, Wilmington Trust, with Southern California locations in Los Angeles in New and Costa Mesa. That's Wilmington Trust with more than 110 years in the corporate trust business. The Web Spirit Store, Empire Nissan, The Double Tree by Hilton Claremont, Jeff Hamill and Nicholas Neese with Wheeler Stephen Sotheby's International Realty, and Hen Hendrix Pharmacy. We thank you for watching this broadcast, and before we get literally blown off the air, we're going to go ahead and go off the air before all of our equipment gets blown down. Again, we'd like to thank you for joining us. For Madison Steinorth and Alevgar and McDermott, I'm Frank Dariano. The final here, 2-0 Webb over San Dimas. Have a good evening.